Hey guys, it's Lacrosse Meets Metal uh, with a newer helmet review. Uh, you would have seen my uh, CLH or CLK2 helmet uh, from the videos a while ago, but um, I got a new one the other day at practice uh, that was school colors, and we just got new um, decals on it and everything, so I'm going to go ahead and show that to you. This helmet is still the, the same uh, CLH2 design. It does not have a little thing that, you know, tells that but I just know it because of the uh, resemblance um, it's in a royal blue visor and it's got a uh, silver uh, in a main paint job for the helmet part um, what's new about this helmet is like I said the MCQ for McQueen Lancers um, it's got these up top you know little stickers to put on for the uh, vents up top um, this one, the white, was originally supposed to come with this uh, style of helmet. However, the blue, um, as you can see out here, it doesn't fit all the way because uh, uh, due to a uh, manufacturer error, um, he made these to fit the Pro 7s, and these are not Pro 7s. But we kept them anyway because we were a lot, we uh, stretched them out. And we had cut off these right here because, um, like these, they did not fit. Uh, another thing to this helmet would be the school logo or the name in the back, the Lancers. And I uh, thought that was pretty cool. Thought I'd show that to everybody. Um, as far as the helmet goes, it's uh, extremely, extremely comfortable. There is a little thing in here. It's uh, This helmet's from Cascade. Um, it says this is the SPR fit. And so all the padding inside of the interior is all new and uh, it fits really well. And uh, it's comfortable, it's not loose, you know. And you can adjust it from the back thing right there. I haven't used it yet because it was just totally a perfect fit right from the start. Um, I would put it on, but <laughs> that's something to kind of decipher later. You know, I was kind of goofy uh, with just the helmet. Um, you know, normal normal warnings and uh, regulations about the helmet inside. Uh, chin strap. Chin strap is still the same, you know, got little hooks uh, for the sides of the helmet and everything just to hook it on. Secure fit, and, um, adjustable, like uh, every helmet is to contour, get the shape of your head. And um, aside from that, I guess there's only a few dings because, <laughs> you know, I've used it already. Um, CLH2s are really awesome, in my opinion. I mean, they're very, uh, they're very standard, and the, uh, you know, they fit about anybody. But if you want a nicer helmet, get a Pro Seven or uh, I don't know what the other one was. And then there's the new Warrior Warrior T Two that just came out a while ago, I think, uh, around summer, and uh, those are pretty nice as well too. So if you have any questions or uh, anything about you know helmet you should get, ask me. Uh, you know, I mean, like, ask me questions, like, as far as price range and then, uh, you know, f your financial stability like that because, um, I mean, I'm not trying to, like, ask for your bank account information. Just, you know, to clarify. I mean, just like, you know, oh, well, I want a helmet that's around this budget, you know. Um, like, let's say you kind of have, like, a lower budget, but you had enough. I'd say get a CLH2 because they're not that much expensive. And uh, they contour very well to the shape of your head, like I said earlier. And um, they're comfortable. But if you want something in the higher end, get a Pro 7 or a T2. Um, but uh, I think, like, for this helmet, um, the helmet that you get with your team will be the helmet everybody gets. Um, I mean, there are some people on uh, my team that have Pro 7s that they just got painted and if your coach or uh any other you know team uh helmet designer somebody can do that for you that'll probably be good but otherwise they usually just give you everyone the same kind of helmet which in this case is a clh2 in uh, my team so uh that's the review on that and be sure to tune into the next review i'm going to be reviewing uh my uh cleats those are pretty cool so that's it for now this is lacrosse meets metal signing off